Come in the front door. This is 120 Carapines. You're in the living room area, all carpeted. This is what would be the dining room. The kitchen is to the left. It's an enclosed plan. Kitchen is closed off. Typical older house. Got a kitchen. Decent sized kitchen, good flow. Uh, back door, which goes out to the yard. And then the laundry area. A little alcove. Hot water here. And back looking back at the kitchen. So you could get a table in the kitchen if you move this piece of furniture. Or again, you can use the dining room. This would be the dining area. This is a garage to the exterior. It's got like a little storage room, mud room. Um, this mud room is not air conditioned. Uh, this is a door into what used to be a door to the storage room from the garage. You'll understand that in a moment. And again, door to the exterior. And then this is the door into the converted garage. It's a four inch step down into the garage. This area looks like it's finished pretty well. A little water stain in the carpet there. Not sure if that's from a potted plant or a leak. And then there is the other door that goes to that mud room area. Uh, this room is air conditioned, so the renovation was done well. It's nice and cool in here. Then you continue down the hall, typical. Carapon's house. We've got a room on the left, which is a bedroom with linoleum. Very strange. And you've got your standard bath. Single sink, toilet and tub, done a little bit of an upgrade with a tile surround in the tub. And you've got a hall closet, bedroom on the left. Again, typical layout closet. I'd say these bedrooms are larger than the other house we looked at in Carapines. Then you've got the master bedroom. You've got a closet in the master bedroom. Location for the bed. The master bedroom is actually smaller than the last house we looked at in Carapines. And then off the master you have full bath. Single sink, toilet, and then a tub. This house does not have walk-in closets.